Welcome to the barn. This week, we're introducing you to our new, I say project, but like, you know what we do. We bring in cars, relatively stock, and we spice them up just a little bit, just to make them like a little bit cooler, a little bit more appealing, like the SL and the stuff that we got going on around us. And today we had a W126, and now these are the unloved SS class. SS class, S class. People, not a huge fan of them. I love them. And I love that old school sort of EMG vibe that they brought when you do them properly. So that's what we're gonna do with this car. So we're gonna give you a quick rundown. We, got, we had the car delivered on Sunday. It's beautiful. It looks a little rough at the moment, but I will run through it in a little bit and we'll explain it. But we got loads going on down here. If you are a new subscriber, we've had loads of subscribers over the last couple of weeks. The channel is doing really well, thank you so much. We have loads of 80s, 90s, 70s Mercs. BMs, all that sort of stuff. So if you are interested in what we do and you like what we're doing in these videos, just like and subscribe, helps us a lot. We're able to produce these videos for you then. So we'll do a quick rundown of what we got in here, which will be, if you go back through our videos, you will see him, uh, which is the E21. We have a proper video on this one very soon because this is almost, Almost ready. It's about to go off for, for um, the carbs to be set up. It's got twin 40s and this is going to be beautiful, but I think it's provisionally sold. But more on that. The E30, engine's in. Ashley's here. He's putting it together. We've ordered a load of parts. This will be together very, very soon, but we'll do another a video on that. So we're going to do a video on this, a video on that. If you want to see the first videos, go back through our history and see those videos. They're, they're quite good quite good. The SL is just being sold. So we're running through it quickly. It needed tracking and little bits. We're going to give it a service and then she's out the door. We're going to drop it up to the guy because he lives not far from Mr. Luke Dale and I want to visit him anyway. So we're going to film that, drop it up to him. He's a really, really nice guy. Now we're going to head up to the barn, which is our little holding area for all the cars before they come down here to get worked on. So let's head up there now. Have a look at this uh, 126 and show you the plans. And I, I forgot, I, for, I actually forgot, and I don't know how, I had my E28 back. Now, this thing is incredible. Okay, so this is our storage barn, and let's take you to show you this beautiful 126. Now, like, I know what you're gonna say. You're gonna look at it now, and you're like, me, that's rough. It's not, and I'll explain why. And then we're gonna explain what we're gonna do and then it'll start to all make sense. So let me pull it out. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> no, no, I'm double down and down. <laughs> Is it gonna start? It's been sat for a little bit. Is it gonna start? If this starts, we're on a winner. Holy shit, it's starting straight off the button. <laughs> Holy Put the arm rest down. It's so comfy. I'm going to pull it out. Do you like the Ambassador Sedan back in the day? Would have driven one of these. Do you like him coming to America? Do you know when he drove around looking for in his son? What was his son's name? Akeem? Was it Akeem? Don't know. He drove around in one of these. You know, the king drove around one of these. That's what this is. And I've been wanting to do one of these for ages because everybody buy. Oh, let me turn it off. Because everybody buys these and leave them stock. And like, have you seen the 80s, like AMG, Brabus versions of these? They look insane. So that's what we're going to do. So we started with a very, very solid base car. Ignore that. And. <laughs> We'll sort that. It's not too bad, it's not, it's not that bad. So we started with this lovely thing that I found at one o'clock in the morning on eBay, right? And I paid a decent amount of money for it because it's low mileage, it's a 300 SE, so it comes with that M103 12 valve six pot, which is bulletproof, right? It's in this lovely gray color. But most importantly, most importantly, it's got this lovely 
black interior. Now, as you guys know, I'm all about the spec. And you can buy these cars in a shitty red color. If you have one, it's not shit. And it comes with that cream interior. And if you're buying one, it's not shit. <laughs> but the better ones are always in black. Like the black interior is great. So this gray on black is perfect. So this car really appealed. Obviously low mileage as well. It had good MOT history. So it's not a rotter because these do suffer from rust quite bad. This has little bits like, like that and this. And this guy has covered this with duct tape. We'll, we'll put that back. <laughs> we'll leave that there for now. The reason I bought this car is because it comes with some, some bits because this guy wanted to make it a Minto. Let's see what we got. Now, I haven't even looked in here yet. He did say it came with some parts, so let's have a look. Okay, so we have some brand new wings. Great. We have that missing side molding. Also great. The tow bar cover for the bumper. Great. I don't even know what this is. Oh! <laughs> we have some smoked rears. These are definitely going on. Oh, they're definitely going on. These are definitely going on. So we got brand new smoke rears. Oh, we got some smoke fronts as well. This guy must be a gangster. I think he was Polish, but a Polish gangster. <laughs> anyway, the plan with this car is we've already bought the wheels. I'm not going to tell you what they are yet. And I've already ordered a kit. If you've seen what these looked like when AMG brought them out back in the day and when they modified them, they looked very, very cool. Color coded everything. They settled it up a bit. Uh, so that's what we're going to do with this. But what we're going to do, because I haven't driven it yet, is take it for a quick spin. Should we go for a spin? Old jokes aside, the interior in this car is f***ing mint. And like, I know I say that all the time. It is that good. Look at that radio though. Let's try. <laughs> oh my God, it's a f***ing prestige. Worldwide. <laughs> we're prestige worldwide. <laughs> Let's put this shit on and see if we get some f***ing tunes on before we take our spin. Holy shit, how old is this? It's on. Oh, and we got channels. Oh, no, no, that's Harry Styles. Sorry, I thought it was something 70s. Tomorrow, it's all a bike jack. Right, we're not winning. We're going to open the sunroof, which works. And then obviously we got these like Gucci and like electric seats. This car like has everything. It's got cruise control. It's got this like lovely wooden gear knob. It has got a rear blind, but it doesn't work. We'll fix that. Let's take it for a little spin, see what it's like. We won't go too far because it doesn't have a lot of fuel. What do you think so far, Rich? Yeah, it's comfy. It's comfy though, isn't it? I feel like if we had an accident in this car, we'd be, fine. We'd be absolutely fine. Holy shit. It drives nice. It looks like a rusty piece of shit, but it drives nice. And the rusty bits are bolt on bolt off parts, right? Apart from that rear door, which we will be able to repair. It's not bad. Like this is really nice. I'm not even mad. It's huge though, isn't it? So plants, wheels, lows, body kit, paint. This is gonna be very simple, but you seen what a piece of shit looks like right now? And it ain't gonna look like a piece of shit when we finish with it. It's gonna look amazing and then you're gonna wanna buy it. In all fairness, this thing does drive really, really nice. I'm not even lying. I like it. So that's our little update on what's going on this week. To everybody who's subscribed so far, thank you so much. We're having a blast. This will be going up to next as soon as we get all the parts in. We are working a little magic on this and this is gonna be a fantastic car. If you are interested in this car already, drop us a message. Get your name in first in it because everything that we seem to be putting up that we do a little bit of a story on and build, you seem to be liking. The SL sold in like, what, two hours? Yeah. Oh, like, and that was off Instagram. So like and subscribe, follow us on Instagram. you see us what we do on the daily. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Ciao, ciao. Right. He's still filming. Mm. This car is going to be amazing. He's he like, when am I ever wrong though? Mind you. Sometimes. <laughs>
<laughs> quite a long time. But it is going to be amazing. F*** you, Rich.